Bubble. That'll go. Alright, easy. You've got. I'm gonna say um, this is Limpopo. We say she's lift tusk, and then also you can take a look at the tip of her tusk. She has a notch known as the grass notch um, because they use the tusks obviously to break the twigs or trees or whatever it is. So they form the notch. But with certain elephants, it's, 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 it's different uh, depending on how uh, practically they use the, the tusks. So I will show you later on on, on uh, Booby. You know, hers is more right tusk, but the notch is underneath, which is very, very funny. Uh, we'll show you that later on. So that, that shows as well, when they break the trees, um, they use the tusk mostly. They break it up, like pulling it up. But instead, booby, she does it downwards, you know. She pulls it down. So that's why she forms the notch on the other side or underneath the tusk. All right, so yeah, it's very interesting when it comes to tusks. I mean, um, it's a tool or sometimes becomes a weapon when they're defending themselves. So they normally use tusks, but obviously all the time they must be right or left to task. Very much like humans, right-handed or left-handed. Once again, now we're going to show you a little bit about Booby's task. Like, you remember we spoke about the tasks yesterday. So, if you take a look on Booby's task, the notch is underneath instead of being on the top. Okay, so she actually breaks trees downwards instead of upwards, what the others do. Somebody, come on, come on. If you take a look here. Um, you see the notch is right underneath there instead of being on the top so um, that shows you whenever she breaks trees she does it downwards okay and most of them they do it upwards so it's, it's very strange and it's, it's quite interesting to see how they they actually develop the skills to use tasks you know um, you may find some of them as well like I said yesterday left or right task but you may find some of them use both tasks equivalently so it's it's very very interesting 